Then in a, a frustrating day today, not the outcome we were after at all. What's your immediate thoughts after that? Uh, we know it's listen, at the end of the day it's not good enough from from anyone and every, all of us have got to look in the mirror, especially myself. Um, I think we did we let everyone down today, the club, the fans. Um, so I mean it, it's evident that there will be changes in January, do you know what I mean? So at the end of the day the club just need to stick with us, the fans need to stick with us and hopefully we can we can start picking something up, do you know what I mean? At the end, we need we need we need better quality and that's, it's that simple really. Unlucky not to get off the mark today, effort cleared off the line in the, the opening minutes and then the, the rebound blocked as well. Yeah, but again that's something that do you know what I mean? For me I should be burying that, do you know what I mean? So for me for me personally it's not good enough. I've not been good enough this, this year. Um, I'll put my hands up to that, do you know what I mean? So but as a team, we need to be collectively, we need to stick together and, and, and try and work through it and hopefully things can change. Those uh, chances from yourself, though, that were cleared off the line ultimately fell for Paul Payton, give us the, the kind of early goal. We got off to a good start and that's the thing. And then things after 10 minutes seem to go against us. Yeah, I think obviously, you know, at the end of the day, we, we, started, we started well, we started bright, we started playing the ball over the top, which is what we was aiming to do, try and get them on the back foot early. Um, we got the first goal and thought, you know, it could be, it, obviously, we, we, obviously everyone would have thought it would, it would be a good day for us, but how things changed, it, as soon as they got a goal, kind of, I could say heads dropped, but then we got our second goal back, and then obviously second half came and we just, we just went up to it, to be honest. So. And that's the thing, what changed second half? Because we'd done the hard bit, as you say, from getting back on level terms right before half time. Uh, I think we. I'm not, I'm not too sure to be honest what changed in the second half. Uh, I just think that we need to play with a lot more confidence, myself included, in, in everything I'm saying. Like, I think we need to play with a lot more confidence and we need to start driving at players, beat players, play in the final third a lot more, get more shots on target. Because at the moment it's, it's like we're we're working, but we're not. We're, we're very defensive, and I feel like we're we're, we're trying we're trying to, to we're trying to get on the on the front foot, but it's just not falling for us at the moment. And it's, that's just. The way it's going. And obviously sometimes that, that little bit of luck as well goes against us, but the, the, uh, Stenhouse Muir, to their credit today, four chances and, and they took them all. I mean, yeah, I mean, 100% I agree with that comment. I mean, no disrespect to them, but we're a team that should be coming here looking to get the win, of course. So for us, it's very disappointing to be able to cut this early. And I think that we just need to, everyone needs to look in the mirror and obviously just dust ourselves off and go again. You uh, obviously had a fairly good backing here today. Are you surprised at the number of fans that turned out despite the kind of league position and stuff? No, oh, 100%. I mean, for a performance like that, we don't deserve that many fans. It's that simple. Um, we, we've come here. We've come here to try and to try and get through the cup. I know it sounds harsh, but at the end of the day, it's the harsh reality of football. And I think we haven't played well enough to get that many fans. And it's that simple. And just finally, then of course we're back on the on the road next week. Long trip north. Can we turn things around and get an immediate reaction? Hopefully that's the plan, Joe. I mean, at the end of the day, now we've got to focus on the league and we've got to pick things up. We've got to fight for each other like we have, you know, like we have done the past few weeks. I mean, the game against Dunfermline, Ross County, Park Thistle, we was all running for each other, we was all fighting for each other and that's where we got the results. Today, it just didn't happen for us and, and that's unfortunate, do you know what I mean? But at the end of the day, we've got to focus now on, on Saturday's game and, and, and keep things going. And that's it. Dan and as always, thanks for your time. Sure, mate, thanks.